so this is the farthest that we can drive. Violet, just put it back on. I've been trying to listen to this song the entire trip. Willow, in case you didn't notice, we're in the middle of the woods. Can we just try and have a normal conversation? It doesn't even matter, guys. We're at the park now anyways. Let's get the show on the road. I saw so many animals on the way over here. I love animals. Me too. What's your favorite animal, Stella? The lion, because they're natural leaders. They defend, feed, and protect their pride. What about you guys? I like snakes. They're so tough. You know there's snakes out there? This small, enough venom to kill a full-grown man. I envy that kind of ability. You would choose the snake, Violet. Mine's the bunny rabbit, because they're so cute. So why'd you bring us to this park, Stella? So, I've been having this reoccurring dream for as long as I can remember, and it's about this vulture egg hidden inside this forest that contains magical crystals inside its yolk. Magical crystals? What do, what do they do? They're said to transport us to the Juno Dunes, which is apparently one of the most sacred, energetic places. It's in some other dimension, we just have to find the egg. Yeah, Stella, that's trippy as hell. Sounds like you smoked one too many. <laughs> well, at this point, I'm led to believe that they're premonitions for how long I've been having these dreams. So I want to just try it out in real life and see if we can get there. So how exactly are we supposed to find these vulture eggs? Tap our heels three times and say, There's no place like Juno <laughs> Dunes. There's no place like Juno Dunes. We have to find the fox. He will guide us to where the vulture egg is. I remember something about following the direction of the wind. How do we know which way the wind's blowing? I know how. Just keep moving. I don't know. It looks kind of cool. <laughs> Look at poor <more> you. <coughs> oh. Come on, let's just keep moving. <laughs> Guys, are we almost there yet? My feet are really starting to hurt. Jesus, stop complaining, Willow. I could walk all night if we had to. Shh, guys, I hear something. Ha, 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 ha! My friends, come closer. Come closer. You look lost. This is a very bad place to be lost at. Would you like to be... Unlost? Yes, kind sir. We would love to be unlost. Sir, there's no sirs in this park. Just call me Fox. At your service. I love humans. Humans are my favorite animal. Do you know where the vulture egg is, Mr. Fox? We're trying to get to the Juno Dunes.
Ah, yes, the dunes is a very pristine place. Many moons ago, I knew a girl named Lyra who was banished from her home planet and forced into universal exile at Juno Dunes. But while she was forced to live there, she met a very important companion. She chose the fox. The fox was one of my ancestors. And here I am today to lead you to the Juno Dunes as a tribute. Here, take the axe. It would protect you from the vultures. Head east and follow the wind. Thank you, Mr. Fox. We better get going. It's about to get dark out soon. I got it. Alright guys, ready? Ready? Ready. Oh. oh god, there's the other one. 